Hey guys, so I'm here today to film my favorite summer bright lipstick or bright lip looks for you. I've been really into bright lips this summer and I just kind of want to show you what I've been wearing and what I've been loving so that hopefully you guys can find some awesome brights too. So first I'm just going to say this is the color of my lips. This is nothing on my lips right now. This is my normal pigmentation which is kind of dark so just keep in mind that when I'm trying these lipsticks on for you, the color won't be as, will be different on my lips because they're so pigmented. So the first color I've been loving this month, or this summer, is the um, Hibiscus from the MAC Surf Baby collection. This is just a gorgeous deep, deep coral color. It's so beautiful. So I'm going to put it on for you. So this is what it looks like. It's just a gorgeous deep coral. I'm going to swatch it for you too, so you can see what it looks like on my hand. So this is it on my lips and on my hand. It is, I think it's beautiful. It's a gorgeous wearable coral. I think this would work on light skin tones, dark skin tones. It's beautiful. I've been really liking wearing this with my Paradise Blush, which is the orange blush from the Surf Baby collection. And I also have been really loving it just with like a neutral blush. Like today I'm wearing Max Tenderling and um, Pin Up from Hard Candy. So now that I've taken that off, um, the next color I'm going to show you is Impassioned. This I have showed you before. I think I just showed it to you guys in a haul not too long ago, but I'm just going to show it to you again because I think it's a gorgeous color. If I swatch this for you, you can see it's just a bright fuchsia color. Oh, it's this one here in the middle. It's a bright fuchsia color and it's just beautiful. As I described before, it's like a perfect watermelon pink. This one is an amplified and um, Max Surf Baby Hibiscus is a cream machine. So this is what it looks like. Again, this is what it looks like on my hand and on my lips. Um, I think it's gorgeous. I absolutely love it. This I like to wear with just like well-dressed blush or Briar Rose blush or even again, Tenderling. Tenderling is kind of my go-to neutral blush. It works really well and it's just the most neutral blush. It's the only neutral blush that I really own. So yeah, love Impassion. So next I'm gonna show you my red um, lips that I like. Um, I will show you what it looks like to just wear my cherry lip liner and also what it looks like to just wear my Marcel lipstick. Actually, I'll do the lipstick first so that I can put the lipstick over top of the cherry eyeliner for you, or lip liner for you guys. So I'm going to do this kind of sloppy because I'm too lazy to line my lips, but normally, as I told you guys before, I would use my Sigma E05, just a pointed eyeliner brush, but I'm lazy today. Sorry, guys. So you can see I kind of messed up on my cupid's bow, but other than that, I think this is a beautiful, deep, kind of perfect red. I don't think it's too deep and it's not too bright. I would kind of like, I kind of want like Lady Danger, but I think it's a matte and that kind of scares me, but I do really like this red. It's right here again. This is it on my lips and this is it on my hand and I just think it's a gorgeous, vibrant red. So I'm going to try to take it off as gracefully as possible and then apply my lip liner, which is going to take a long time. I'll probably have to fast forward through that. So I'm going to show you what cherry looks like. I will swatch it on my hand for you. It's the one that's vertical up here. No, horizontal. I lied. Horizontal. And I'm going to try to do this as quickly as possible. So I did that one pretty decently. This is what it looks like. Um, I have some smudges around my lips, but normally what I would do is go around it with concealer and blend it out. But this is what it looks like with just the cherry on my lips. I think it looks really gorgeous. And I would also, normally what I do is I put um, my e.l.f. Super Glossy Lip Shine with SPF 15 in, this is called Juiced Berry. It looks like a nice kind of corally color in the tube, but as you can see, I just swatched it here. It's a shiny part on my arm, on my hand, and it is literally just clear. But because I'm going to show you the lipstick with, the lip liner with the lipstick on top, I'm not going to put the gloss on today, but again, this is what cherry looks like on its own, and then this is what it looks like if I put Marcel on top of it. 
And I'm sorry if I'm talking really fast. I'm just trying to like get through this without running out of time. I want to say that this lipstick is so creamy. Again, this is the uh, Rouge Expression number 901 in Amour from Marcel, and it is the creamiest lipstick ever. I would say it's very much like a cream sheen kind of finish. It's not matte. It's not too fro it's not frosty. It's kind of a matte shade with a glossy kind of finish. It looks so beautiful. So I know those red variations probably look ridiculous to you guys because they don't look like they're any different at all, but I'm crazy. <laughs> so yeah, that's they look different to me and I wear them differently. Like Obviously it looks very similar when I put it all on in the same day, but normally I just, depending on how I'm feeling or if I'm feeling lazy, I kind of wear it differently. So now I'm gonna try to remove this as carefully as possible again, and I'm gonna show you my last favorite bright pink, or bright color, but it's pink one. My face probably looks crazy. It looks, it's really, really red around my mouth right now. I've been just applying my MAC Marilite Skin Finish in between lipsticks kind of around my mouth to kind of mute the color for you guys. Again, not what I would normally do, but that's what I'm doing right now. So my last lipstick that I've been loving is the Kissable Lip Color in Scandalous, I believe. Yep, yeah, Scandalous is so beautiful. Oh, it's called Scandalicious. Wow, I've been calling it Scandalous. I think it's because it was, I'm pretty, I'm 99% sure that Temptalia called it Scandalous on her blog, so that's why I've been calling it Scandalous, but yeah. It's one of these, it has the lip gloss applicator, but it's a lipstick and it's very long. It's not very, very long wearing, but it wears as long as a lipstick does, longer than a lip gloss does. So that's good. So I'm going to apply it for you guys and show you. And I applied it really messily. Because the wand is hard to kind of control, I find, but I do think that it's a gorgeous color. I will swatch it for you guys. It's a very deep pink, but it's still bright, and it's still, like, it's like, wha-bam in your face. So this is what it looks like here, and again, this is what it looks like on my lips. Such a gorgeous pink color. I totally love it. So those are my favorite brights. I hope this was helpful to somebody. I hope you guys found some, maybe some nice colors, because I know sometimes, you know, some people wearing lipsticks and videos and you don't know what they are and this is what I've been wearing all summer long so it'll continue to wear probably into September because they are beautiful colors. So thanks for watching and I'll see you guys later. Bye.